The first thing you observe in function is that f of x is used in place of y. That is, instead of writing y is equal to the square root of 2x minus 5, we can write it as f of x is equal to 2x minus 5 in square root. Secondly, we use r to represent real numbers. All the numbers found on the number line is called real number. Numbers moving towards negative infinity and positive infinity, including zero. Real numbers is the parent name for both rational numbers and irrational numbers. However, inside rational numbers is integer, whole numbers, and natural numbers. Real number is like the parent name of a large extended family on the number line from one to infinity is known as natural numbers when you include zero going towards infinity is known as whole numbers when you consider all the numbers going towards the negative infinity and also towards the positive infinity it is known as integers including zero when you divide a whole number with another whole number which is simply known as fractions and the answer produced is reoccurring that is repeating like in 1 over 3 7 over 11 2 over 9 7 over 9 and so on where the numbers are repeating or where the answer produced is short and not reoccurring it can be negative or positive it can even be a whole number dividing by one which will return back the whole number when any of the three mentioned conditions is satisfied it is simply known as rational numbers the result of any division square root or representing value that will not repeat or reoccur for example 9 over 46 22 over 7 square root of 2 and so on is simply known as irrational numbers in conclusion natural number is inside whole numbers whole number is inside integers and integers is inside rational number while re number is the parent name for both rational and irrational number in precalculus. You can check out other videos by following the link on the screen. I will see you in the next video.